Hi, this is John Hillbrands, and I'm going to talk a little bit about something that a number of my customers mentioned to me, and that is that they'll say they can feel the tacks, and I can feel them here um, through the carpet. So you can see that there's a thinner section of carpet, and we can feel the tacks, um, tack strips. And I've had customers say that, you know, their kids will actually get bloody feet. But we can see that everything about this is fine. It's going into the car, into the tile edge. We don't have a gapped edge. So the only problem is the nails. And if you think of a tack strip, basically they're, uh, they're nails that are at this angle. So they're kind of perched like this. So when carpet gets stretched, it falls into the nails. Now, if you can imagine, they're kind of pitched like this. Let me flip my hand over. They're pitched like this. Um, through continuous action, they may eventually go up a little bit. So they may get through on their own, or it might be just that the carpet is getting so thin that even though they're pitched correctly, you can still feel them through. So what is the solution? Well, first off, you need something to keep you from tapping on the conk, on the, on the tile. And I'm going to try and do this with one hand here. But, and then you're just going to do this. So you just tap those nails down. And of course the cardboard is so you don't clip a tile edge. So get it nice in the groove and then just do this, okay? You can also do this and sometimes you can just press them down. But once you press them down, what we're doing is we're bending them back down a little bit. So they're not popping up through the carpet. So you don't need to add more tacks on the surface. You don't need to lift it up. None of that. You just need a little tapping to make them go flat again. And just that simple tapping, I no longer feel the nails. There's one right there. So let me... So that's actually how you do it, is you feel the nail that is offending you. There we go. And you just tap it down. So a simple solution, but I can't imagine people having their children have bloody feet just because of something that's a one one minute task but you can make a one minute task completely ruin a tile you can make it really get bad if you don't take some precautions if you're completely crazy with a hammer making big old swings you know and then you can even knock that out of the way and chip a tile so just be calm and get it um, to where and just do a little tapping while you're holding that cardboard to keep it from proceeding into the tile all right simple solution but it solves that tack strip poking you through the carpet problem this has been john with hill brown's carpet care and if you're in the temecula area you can give me a call I've done this for people for free while I'm carpet cleaning, and I've also restretched it where there's a little gap, and then we can restretch it and do a little fixing, which you know would probably be a, I don't know, thirty-five, fifty-dollar uh, add-on of a carpet cleaning job. All right. Um, once again, John with Hillbrands Carpet Care. You have a good day. Thanks. Bye bye.